I am definitely a Gemini, and I fit that personality and all the traits of it to a T. Clemson football is very important to me because my cousin Cole is the kicker for Clemson, and my family is probably first and foremost. If I'm running out really quick to go on a trip and I have to grab three things, they are my iPod, my hand-woven shoes, because my feet take enough abuse, they need comfort, and my limited edition Ray-Bans, yeah. There's a lot of things that I can't live without. I really like my car. I really like my Olympic ring because it's been like my whole lifetime in the making. That's a simple guy. He's got to get that Clemson down though with a P. There's no P there, but he's got to work in a southern accent. It's tough out in Hollywood, I know. Evan Lysacek, the world bronze medalist, in second. Hard to believe, Paul, that he's never won a gold medal in the Grand Prix series. This could be it. We'll see. This program, of course, a very strong take at Carmen. Famous comeback in the Olympics in Torino. He had the flu. He was in 10th place after the short program. Came all the way back up to fourth with a brilliant long program. He opens here with a triple combination, triple lutz, triple toe loop, nice and strong. Second jump, triple axle. Tilted in the air, and turn out there. So three consecutive silvers in the Grand Prix. Two world bronze medals. He's talked about scrapping this program and getting a new one, but I don't know. I feel like he's just coming into the uh, to his own with it. This program choreographed by Lori Nickel. Comes the second triple axel after the halfway mark. In the combination. Do you think it's a mistake for skaters to stick with programs for more than one season? I think most feel a need to change just for the sake of change that next year. It's a personal thing, and you know you don't want to err on the side of having a program too long so that people are sick of it. But if it's working for you, and it is working for Evan Lysacek, then I would say keep going with it. jump. Crowd getting into the cadence of this performance. And obviously there are some empty seats here. It's not an easy place to get to. It's outside the city and tickets are the equivalent of about 12 
U.S. dollars. And as always, you deal with the smog here, getting to the arena. This element for me is a highlight, this straight line step, because I just love the way he uses every piece of it. You can feel the electricity of it. You can tell he puts a lot of energy. Technically difficult changes. He's using his head and his arms and his feet. He's got to be happy with that. There was great intensity. His jumps were strong, footwork and spins. And, you know, this could be his first gold medal in a Grand Prix. It's amazing. He's one of the better known skaters in the world on the men's side, but he's only won one senior title to date. That was the Four Continents Championship in 2005. It started with a triple X, triple toe combination. This was 10 points. And, you know, just very nice speed out of it, good air position. And the triple axle just a little bit tilted in the air. He does get the full rotation. The air position just a little bit loose, and he has to flip out of it there. Now that's a mistake. And then the triple-double combination, three jumps. These add up to very good points at uh, 9.13 because it comes after the half. That's very, very strong. Now you know, as Frank Carroll, Ken Kajemi said alongside the Kiss and Cry, that he'd love to wear gold for the first time in the Grand Prix Series. This is the regular season. It lays the groundwork for what you do at the National Championships, the World Championships, and that's going to be more than enough. All he needed was 129.92, and in the past he scored as high as 152. Look at this, 150.84, and that is a runaway victory for Evan Lysacek. And still no smile from Frank Carroll. <laughs> <laughs> they don't realize it yet, the total number here. It's all in Chinese being announced. And now, yeah, right, there you go. The wave to the camera. Evan Lysacek wins by more than 20 points. Sergei Davidov, his first medal in the Grand Prix Series. And Emmanuel Sandu edges out Scott Smith for the bronze. And Peter Carruthers is with us.